on an orange epic advice so today we are going to be doing a minecraft tutorial this should work on any device you are using so pc nintendo switch xbox ps4 whatever you're using it should work so let's get let's see if we can get onto this tutorial. <laughs> again and then on the top it would be closed then when you open it again if you did not notice a water bottle should have came up you close it and if it did not came up all you gotta do is get is get um a water bucket that will still work you take some out put it back in it still works so let's get on to today's tutorial this is probably a good area to make it as a lot of space so what you are going to be needing is you are going to be needing some sticky pistons some redstone dust a cauldron um how about we grab and that's basically it i'm really feeling and i think you need one more thing redstone comparator and one more thing water bucket so then you rule them you want to do is you want to also get a block of your choice and make like a little wall so like it doesn't matter of this tutorial but but just for this just pretend this was going to be a wall three high at least it doesn't have to be exactly three high but you should have your wall at least three high so something like this so what you want to do is place your cauldron down then you want to delete these two blocks so right next to the cauldron one block right here delete these two then you're going to get your redstone comparator place it right there should be fa the two your two things should be facing here and that little button right here should be facing outwards then what you want to do is this activates it so once you put water bucket it should activate the redstone comparator so that's how this works right here the, redstone, the water is powering up the redstone comparator then what you want to do is place a red block of your choice right here Oh, one more thing. We need a slab. So let's just get, I don't know. I'm just going to get a quartz slab. Then put put uh, put it right next to here floating. Then put another right here. And then another block of your choice right here. And then put it along right here. So it should be in front, side, here. Then it should start glowing. That means it is activated. Then what you want to do is you want to go one, two, three, right underneath the thing, add a sticky piston. So what th this is going to do is this is going to activate our block, maybe, and then get a block of the environment around you. So I would, this is where the secret hideout is going to be. So keep that in mind. I right think that is going to be my secret hideout right there. Cover that up. Then, so now what we're going to do is we're going to build the one, that, the lever that goes inside so you got so you can just like activate inside so it did that so you don't have to go inside activate it go whatever you need to do and leave that just open until you put more water in it no we're professionals here we're our zipping advice we don't do slipperness so what we're gonna do is you're gonna dig two blocks deep right next to the sticky piston it should have been activated so it should be right the extend and then you have and then right next to the sticky piston it should so this is what you should have then you want to delete one block down you will see that then go here delete two down then what you're going to get is you want to get yourself a lever a fine dandy lever like a regular lever then what you want to do is place some redstone right here it should go like a straight line ish then you get a lever place it right there and then it won't activate because you have to what you got to do is you have to open this up first so let's just get glass bottle right now no this is the wrong material material 
No, that's that's not the right thing. What is that? So let's just play, replace it with our cauldron. Done. You have to take some water out, and then it would open. But it, once you're in the hideout, you close it like that. Then you open it from that, and then you put some water back in so it closes. So it should work right there. Then what you want to do, since this would be right here, this would be nothing. It would be blocked off here. So just like cover this wall right here. Just cover this wall. I don't even care how you cover it. Cover it at least. Like something like that. So it looks like a casual regular just thing. Oh look, we need to go in the space. Then what you want to do once you get in the base, just delete, block, block, until you find the lever, then close that lever up. You might want to add a couple of lights, a couple more details. Not like mine. My, your, yours probably going to be way more prettier. And I saw, so sorry guys, but I made a secret base and I literally destroyed it. I will show you that at the end of the video right now. Okay, so add a, maybe like delete this or so, whatever you want to do. Put the light, whatever you want. Close that, and then you got a homemade base. So it basically does, let me close that for a second. Let me just delete that pretty quick. And this is what it would look like. So it would look like just a regular sink. A couple of water just got out because we are, uh, because it should have done that because it can't put water back in. So it does do that. So thanks for so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoy the video and smash that like button if you want some more. So, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. And see you next time on Orange Epic Advice. What you can get. Nothing crazy, but some water. A fire went up. And thanks. So, bye. <laughs>